welcome to today's vlogmas day 13 Eek! another day another gift guide for you guys today's gift guide is about things that i have bought for my nine week old baby and my almost two year old little boy yesterday's video was about my three year old twins i got boy girl twins if you want some inspiration on what to get your three year olds then go and check out that video i will link it in the description for you and i'll say at the beginning of this video because i said at the end of the last one i'm going to be doing a live come wrap with me so i'm going to set up my camera and we're going to do a live stream of me wrapping up christmas presents and feel free to come and do your wrapping up alongside me. I'm gonna be doing it for a while. It takes me a while to wrap things up. I absolutely love wrapping things up and I will be doing it on a number of different days. So I'm gonna do AM and PM UK time. So wherever you are in the world, hopefully one of those times will suit you and you'll be able to join in if you wanted to. And I'm pretty sure because it's live, it will still be shown on my channel. You can come back and watch it whenever you want. So it's gonna be a good couple of hours slot. I will let you all know when I'm gonna do that because I'm not completely sure when I'm gonna do it but it's gonna to have to be very, very, very soon. It's probably going to be a weekday and a weekend. It's just about who's watching the kids because I have got five of them. Well, one of them's really big, she's 17, but I have four under the age of three. So it's fitting time around my little family. I will put it on my YouTube channel when I'm gonna be doing it. So make sure you are subscribed and make sure you have pressed the bell to all of my updates so you don't miss out on when it's gonna be. Let's get on with today's video. Let's start with my almost two year old boy. George loves to throw things, to smash things up. <laughs> He's such a, he is a lovely little boy, by the way. He likes to throw things. He does like to break things. I think it's just his age. And he also likes to do the cleaning. He loves doing the cleaning. He likes to get the hoover out and all those things. So this is what we got George. We do, oops fell off my seat. We do have something similar to this already, but this is a little bit different because it is a proper cleaning set that he can pull along with him. The other thing we've got is a wooden set by Melissa and Doug, which is beautiful by the way. And it's just got the mop and the brushes hanging off of it, like a little, like a hat stand like that. But this one is a trolley, which he can pull around with him with everything on. And he, I just think, this is just so George, he's gonna absolutely love it. There's everything in there that he could possibly want. I got this from B&M, B&M Bargain, and I'm pretty sure in there, two for 20 pounds off, I think it's 15 pounds or it's on its own. Here we go, it's on this side. Look, 15 pounds. It says two for 24 pounds, it's not, it's two for 20 pounds now, so if they've got any left, I would go and have a look, especially if your child loves a bit of cleaning. And, oh my goodness, I really should start taking things out of boxes before I do these. This is stuck. Ooh. This is, oh, here we go. Look, what does that say? That says Dyson. He has got, yes, yes, I know what you're saying. You are shouting it at the screen as we speak. I'm gonna wrap it up, make it for him, rather than him just get a box to open on Christmas day. He has got, oh, a little Dyson. And here's the handle that goes on it. But yeah, this is it. They're so much cheaper than I thought they were gonna be. I think it's like about 15 or 16 pounds. Proper impressed with that. And it actually sucks up. It sucks up the fluff on your floor. Come on, what more could you want? So George has got a Dyson Hoover. I'm sure they're all gonna play with it because they'll just all play with each other's toys. I do have three-year-old twins, boy-girl twins as well. So they're all pretty close in age. I think I bought it from Amazon, Amazon or Argos, not sure. Next, George has got the same as my twins, Noah and Rosalie. They have all got one of these hats. I've got this from H&M. It's a gorgeous hat and it is just so, so warm. Inside is a fine fleece it's definitely going to keep him warm outside in the cold weather and the gloves are just just as cute it all matches there's like little ear flaps on it as well well this is from H&M I did say George likes to throw things so I wanted to let him throw things but safely one idea is to just let them throw sock balls so just get a load of socks put it in a ball and let them throw that about or get some real soft, lightweight balls. But I thought I'd get in this. It's a dartboard 
with little sticky balls, which he throws at it. He's gonna absolutely love this and it'll get that that need that he needs to throw things out of him and also because he's going to get something out of it as well he will see them land on here and stick I, th I think he's going to really really enjoy this and hopefully he'll just want to throw these things rather than everything else in the house like the Christmas tree baubles and anything he can get his hands on basically so yeah this hmm where did I get you from I think I got this from Smith's Toys it was either there or Amazon Everything that I can possibly link, I will link it in the description box for you. We live on a new build estate, so the kids have been watching all the machinery going past the front of our house every single day. And they love the diggers and everything. So I've got George a cement mixer. Oh, I thought it was gonna go round. That's a shame. Oh no, it does go round. Oh, there's a little twisty thing here for him to twist it round and round. I got this in Tesco in the summer sale for a bargain of two pounds, but I'm sure you can pick these up anywhere. I'm gonna say Amazon, I love Amazon, I'm just gonna say that you can probably get them from Amazon, but I like to pick things up throughout the year because it makes Christmas a lot cheaper, really. Uh, even though you're still spending the money, it's not so noticeable as well that you are spending money if you pick things up during the year, and especially in January, there's so many bargains on, and in the summertime, there's also a load of stuff on the sale which you think, get that for Christmas because why not? So there we go, this was in the summertime sale in Tesco and I got it for two pounds. And in my last video, the one with my twins, I showed got Noah a digger from Tesco, exactly the same thing, two pounds. And also in my last video, I showed some wooden cutting up things. I got Rosalie a wooden cut up pizza, like she cuts it up herself. And also I got Noah a wooden cut up bits of fruit. You know, the cut up toys. And George, I got him, a birthday cake one because he loves singing happy birthday nearly every day he absolutely loves it so I decided to get him the birthday cake one because it's nice and colorful and he's just he is going to love this I know he is I know my little boy he's gonna love this and this come from Smith's Toy Superstore and I know that because Reese had to go and pick it up so there we go quite heavy actually I reckon this is gonna be really really good quality he's going to really enjoy this George loves to build and he loves to knock things down so I've got him a box of Lego every house needs Lego and George has now got a box of Lego Duplo we do have some Lego already different types of Lego this is different this seems to be different, I keep saying the word different, even though the other one's got different types of shapes and everything, this is different again. And it's got a nice little box that it comes in, which I was really impressed with. It looks like a, just a big Lego piece. So I will link this, I'm pretty sure I got it from Amazon. And yeah, ages one and a half up. He is two at the end of January. This is perfect for him, so yeah. Nice little tidy box for him to tidy it all away in as well. Who doesn't love Lego? Lego is, it's just like childhood memories, isn't it, Lego? Oopsie, right then. So for George, I bought him a magic painting set. It's like no mess, no fuss, no worry. Especially when you're like me and you've got loads of kids to keep your eye on in one go. This is gonna really help my life. So this is lots of little activity books and inside are things waiting to be discovered by your child. So you get these pens, you're filling them up with water and then you just go over the top and the picture appears. There you go, no mess, magic painting. And it all comes in this little box, it's like a briefcase. I've got a, something similar for one of the twins, Noah, and it is a dinosaur box and inside is um, coloring books, activity books with colors and stuff to color in the dinosaurs. And also the box, you color in the box as well. It's got lots of outlines of dinosaurs and stuff and he uses all the colors to color them in. So that was, that's a really good idea. And I absolutely love this. Yeah, one chunky water pen, which is here, eight pictures and two books. So there's lots for him to do in here. And this is from b and it's 15 pounds, or it's in the offer of two for 20, which you don't just have to get two of these, you can mix and match. And there are so many things to choose from. I wanted to get George something cuddly. I've already got the twins something cuddly. I got Noah a 
Humpty Dumpty Teddy because he loves Humpty Dumpty. It is just the cutest teddy ever. I got Rosalie some Squishmallows and I got George this. What is this? I hear you cry. Well, this is a cheeky sloth. This is, oops, a sloth which he wears. You literally, oh my God, that's the first time I've unwrapped it. Like, this is so cute. <laughs> I love it. So this will go around his neck like this. Oop, he'll put it on and then he'll just walk around carrying it. Oh no, I've put it on the wrong way, hang on. So you put it on. Do I put it on the wrong way? Oh, I don't know. You could probably put it on either way. So he puts it on like this and ooh, he carries it like he carries it like it's a baby. So this would go around his little waist. Oh, it's not going to fit me. So he'd literally, <laughs> he'd literally carry it like that. So let's see it. Oh, see what it looks like this way around. So yeah, there we go. This is his, um, this is his, <laughs> I can see myself in the viewfinder. I look ridiculous. <laughs> oh my goodness. But he's not going to look ridiculous. Oh, he's going to look super cute. These are really cheap. They are surprisingly cheap. They are from Smith's Toys. Well, I got this one from Smith's Toys. You could probably get it somewhere else. I don't know. Pretty sure I picked him up for five pounds. That is cheap, especially for what it is. It's not just a teddy. You know, you get to do something with it. I have no idea how this was all put together. How did I put this, how was it? How did it arrive? George's main present is a toddler laptop. This is by VTech. I decided to get him this because when I am doing my work, when I'm trying to edit my videos and things like that, George always wants to help. He wants to press all the buttons and, you know, wipe my work. No, he doesn't. He just likes to press all the buttons. So I've got him this. There's lots of games on there. There's songs. Look, you can even learn a different language. You can learn French. Maybe I'll have a go on it. He can carry it around with him. It's got a little, it's, it's a little case. It just folds up and you carry it around with him. So I got him this. It's aged two to five years. So it's gonna last him a while. He is going to love this. He is gonna love it. And I am so glad that I picked it up for him. I don't even think it's overly expensive. I got the twins. Their main present is a VTech Kitty Zoom Duo camera. So they got one of those each. He's got this, so they'll probably just all play with each other's stuff. So that's George's things. Um, I did say in my last video, I like to get, because I've got four young children, I like to get them present for present. So, you know, like the amount, I try and keep the amount the same. But obviously with Leo, he's nine weeks old, he has no idea about that. Leo doesn't, oh, actually I haven't even counted Leo's presents. He might have the same amount. I'm not even sure about the monetary value with Leo if it matches up to the other three. But let me show you what I got for our nine week old baby. So Leo is nine weeks old when it is Christmas. He'll be almost three months old. So I've got him toys that are from naught plus or three months plus. So this one is three months plus. It's a baby Einstein toy and it plays. Maybe I shouldn't have pressed it. How do I stop? Stop! Right, let me try and turn it off a minute. Okay, it's finished. <laughs> I wasn't expecting it to go on that long. Okay, so this is just a little, well, you know what it is, you just heard it, and he's gonna love it, it's quite colorful. So yeah, that's from Baby Einstein. Pick this up from Smith's Toys. Okay, the next thing I got for Leo is Nought Months Plus because it is a mobile to go above his bed. He hasn't actually got one. At the moment, he has got a snooze pod, so I don't know if I'll be able to attach it to that, but I can certainly play the music to him. But what I like about this is on top of here, it's like a little light show, which will just glow up on the ceiling. And I'm pretty sure it spins around as well. I think it does. So he is going to really enjoy, hopefully, looking at the little light display, listening to the music. And when he's in his cot, which will be in a few months. We will just attach it to the side. So he's already used to the song. He's already used to the music. So when he does that transition into his own 
big bed. Um, hopefully it'll be quite smooth because he is familiar with this and it has some nice little toys as well. I think it's really sweet. This is from Fisher Price and I bought this from, it was either Amazon or Smith Toys, can't remember, one or the other, but I will link it. All of my children have got one of these. It is the Guess How Much I Love You Nut Brown Hair, and they all have one. So now Leo has got one. This is age naught up, I think. Yeah, this is from birth. So yeah, he's got one of these. I absolutely love the, I think I'm gonna pronounce it right, La Maze toys. They are so interesting for the children, especially this one. There's got so much going on. The twins had these toys I can't remember what they had, like a dragonfly. This one's a firefly and something else. So now Leo has got one all for himself. Leo has got some little teeth chompers. I say teeth chompers. Oh, I was gonna say it's because that's what they call it on here. It's called chomper teeth. But you know, it's like the, the teething things. This is from Tesco. And I remember that because it says it on there. This is three months up. If you're gonna do a stocking for your baby, where you, you know you put a little few bits and bobs in, you could put things like this in, which I probably will put it in a little stocking for him, just so he looks like he's got something from Father Christmas, because the children might ask, has Leo been a good boy? Father Christmas in visiting? Father Christmasing? Father Christmas visiting. This I picked up from the works. This is just a little rattle. It says 12 months plus, as me saying I only got things for three months plus. This is 12 months plus. I don't think he's gonna have to wait that long for it. He'll be holding things soon anyway. And there's a little thing inside that you can rattle around. It's a little giraffe rattle. It's a bit of a cause and effect, isn't it? He'll, he'll fling it around, it'll make a noise, and then he'll be happy. I got this from the works as well. This is another rattle, but it's more like a rainmaker with all the little beads in it. So if I turn it up and down, the beads will just go up and down, spin the things around, it's nice and colourful. My first caterpillar rattle, and I'm pretty sure I got this from the works too. If I can't link things from the works, I will try and link something similar on Amazon. So that's what that is. I've also got him some stacking cups, which he can play with soon. This one also says 12 months plus, but there's nothing stopping us or even the kids making little towers for Leo to knock down, even in a few months time. He'll be able to do that. So yeah, just making some little towers on the floor and for him to be able to reach out or even just kick them over. He will absolutely love that, seeing them fall to the ground. So he's got some stacking towers. It's quite hard, isn't it, to buy for a baby because you don't know what they like. This is more of a stocking filler thing, really. I don't think he's gonna get much benefit out of it at the moment, but because I've got these types of things for all the other children when they were this young, I thought, well, Leo should have one as well. I got this from um, Asda, from George Home in, in Asda, and it's just a throw. And each winter they do different types of designs. And this one is quite cute. It's got little guinea pigs on it. So I've just picked up for him. So when he's a little bit older, he can cuddle underneath it or put it on his bed. But I've given it to all of them at a young age, at their first Christmas, actually. So this is one and a half meters by one and a quarter meters. Decent size. That's gonna go in his stocking. And so is this, this is going in his stocking as well. It's a My First Christmas bib. I got this from Sainsbury's. He'll just wear it Christmas day and then probably after then for a while. But yeah, it's a cute little bib, My First Christmas. Something to keep as well because he's not eating food at the moment so it's not gonna be stained and destroyed. Right, I'm just trying to get to the last thing. Cause it's pretty big. We got Leo, this. <laughs> Can you see I'm trying to get it all in the screen? So it's just a big play mat, but it's not any type of play mat. It's really thick and it's got activities on here for him to do. It crinkles and he can, he can look at things. Some things are black and white, which are good for his eyes, especially when he's doing his tummy time, which is here. And then obviously they sit up and he can just generally just play on it. And it's pretty big as well. It is one meter by one and a half meters and it is five centimeters thick. So it's a really good size mat. I got this from 
Smith toys. That is Leo's last present. So that is everything that we're giving the children for Christmas. I will link my other video, the video I did yesterday for the twins, what we got our boy girl, three year old twins for Christmas. If you wanted to go and get some inspiration on that. I've also done a video of things I got from B&M for stocking fillers. I will link that in the description for you as well if you want to go and look at that video. And if you wanted to join in with my live stream that I'm gonna do, wrapping up presents, where I am literally just gonna be sat there wrapping up my presents, you are more than welcome to come and join me. I will let you know when that is gonna be very, very soon. I will put a little note up on my YouTube. So make sure you are subscribed to my channel for that so you don't miss out and make sure you press the alert bell as well. Otherwise you might not see it and I don't want you to miss out. But I hope you enjoyed this video. I will link absolutely everything that I possibly can in the description box. I know I've been saying that all the way through the video but I don't want you to miss out on that either. I hope you liked this video. Please give me a great big thumbs up if you did and I will see you in tomorrow's video. Have a lovely day. Bye.